the main corpuscular hemoglobin and the main corpuscular hemoglobin concentration are part of the RBC indices. The RBC indices are a set of measurements that are used to determine the etiology of anemia. MCH refers to the average mass of hemoglobin in each RBC, which is equivalent to the hemoglobin over the RBC count. MCHC refers to the average concentration of hemoglobin per RBC, which is equivalent to the hemoglobin over the hematocrit. If the MCHC value is abnormally low, erythrocytes are called hypochromic. If it's normal, they're called normochromic. And when it's abnormally high, they're called hyperchromic. Let's simplify this by imagining that our RBC is a donut. In this example, the MCH would tell you how much cream and weight is in each donut, whereas the MCHC would tell you what percentage of each donut is cream. For our second example, let's say we have two cars. Car A is big and has two passengers, while car B is small and also has two passengers. In this case, the MCH would tell you the total weight of passengers that are in each car, while the MCHC would tell you the percentage of the passengers relative to each car. The MCH for both cars will be 100 since they're both carrying the same weight of passengers. On the other hand, the MCHC would differ since it's a percentage between the weight of the passengers or the hemoglobin and the volume of the car or the volume of the RBC. And based on this, we now know that MCH does not account for size, while MCHC does.